So in this video, I want to talk about the input string command, which is just another way of uh, taking uh, input from a user. Just like its name suggests, uh, the input string command is going to treat your input as a string as opposed to um, uh, an expression. That's something the input command does. Okay, so let's go ahead and create a new program. And I am going to name it uh, input S, which is going to stand for input string. Press enter. And uh, I'm just going to show you uh, a quick demonstration of it. As always, I'm going to put a uh, clear IO here to make sure my program starts uh, in a brand new page. And uh, the syntax of uh, the input string command is the same as uh, the regular input. So you're gonna put an input, str, which stands for string. And in a quotation, you wanna you know display a statement. So I'm gonna say uh, enter your name, okay. And I am going to save that in a variable uh, called name. So N-A-M, just name and three letters, okay? And I'm also going to use uh, the input, regular input, and uh, do the same thing with it. Okay, input, uh, enter your name. Okay, so I'm going to save that in a variable called uh, name2, so N-A-M2, just three letters. Okay, and then I want to display both uh, answers. So display statement is gonna display the first uh, input string. So I'm gonna put uh, an indication to tell, uh, so I can, uh, I, uh, so I know which one is being displayed. So I'm gonna say this is uh, uh, input string. I'm just gonna put an input string. And I'm just gonna put a uh, dot name is And I want to display the first name, so that's going to be NA. That's the one that is using the input string command. So the second one is going to just say input. That's just uh, the input regular input command. And it's going to say name is. And it's also going to display my name. Okay. Or whatever name I decided to give it. Okay, so... The program should run fine right now. So let's just go home and uh, put the name of our program, input, open close parenthesis, press enter. And it says enter your name. So I'm just going to put uh, this name. This is kind of my nickname. My nickname is, is pretty long. So I'm gonna press enter. And uh, it's gonna say enter your name again. So I'm gonna do the same thing. Okay. So if I press enter, input string name is then it's gonna display my name and the second input uh, that's just the regular input is also going to display my name but as you can see there is uh, something different about it so the input the second input comment which is uh, uh, just the regular input is going to uh, treat your name differently so that has uh, uh, that, that that input comment is going to you know switch uh, your names around so since D the letter D comes before G so it's gonna switch your name is your name around because that input command is just for expressions and the first input string is uh, it's gonna deal mainly with uh, uh, with strings so yeah so that's the difference between the two and um, there's also a way to convert uh, an input string to uh, an expression which is something I am going to uh, show you in a different video but uh, if you have any questions for now just make sure you put leave in the comment section so now you know that uh, if you want to deal with uh, names, people names, or if you want to deal with just nouns in general, then uh, that's uh, the command you want to use. The input string is the command you want to use because the regular input is going to move your name. Uh, it's, it's, going to, it's not going to deal very well with uh, uh, strings.